With our hectic schedules and convenient food choices, having high levels of uric acid is one problem that many people face. Most of the uric acid formed in the body dissolves in the blood and is excreted through the kidneys. If your body is producing too much uric acid or is not able to remove enough of it, it may lead to painful joint disease called gout. High levels of uric acid in your body can cause several other problems, including kidney stones and even kidney failure in severe cases. The amount of uric acid in your body can be detected through a simple blood test, and no matter how healthy you feel you are, it's important to have regular checkups. Here are some of the simplest ways to control high levels of uric acid. 1. Cut out fizzy drinks. Uric acid forms when the body breaks down chemicals called purines. Sugary, fizzy drinks can increase levels of uric acid in the blood, so avoid grabbing a can when you're thirsty. Cutting out sweet, fizzy drinks can also help you keep an eye on your waistline, as being overweight is another risk factor for gout. 2. Try to go meat-free. Foods such as beef, lamb, game, offal, including liver and kidneys, and some seafoods, such as mackerel, mussels, anchovies, sardines, crab, and herring, are all high in purines. Aim for a diet where only 15% of your daily calories come from animal protein to help reduce your risk. You should also avoid products that contain a meat or yeast extract. 3. Ditch protein-rich diets It's important to maintain a healthy weight to prevent an attack of gout, but crash diets are not the answer. The common low-carb and high-protein diet is rich in purines, so it can increase your risk. 4. Avoid too much alcohol Certain types of alcohol, such as beer and stout, can raise uric acid levels in the blood, so cut these out if you suffer from gout. Spirits are linked to a much lower risk of developing gout and wine. If you stick to the recommended daily amount, it's not linked to an increased risk. 5. Lose some weight. The rise in gout has been linked to our widening waistlines. Around 600,000 Brits have already been diagnosed, and the incidence is increasing by around 4% a year, every year. As we get fatter, experts predict these numbers will rise even further. As well as following a healthy diet, try some simple exercises to help whittle down your waistline, like swimming, speed walking, and doing a light, low-impact cardio workout. 6. Up your water intake Staying well hydrated can help prevent crystals of uric acid from forming in your joints. Make sure you're drinking around 1.2 liters of fluid, including plenty of water, every day. And remember to drink more if you're exercising or if it's hot. 7. Use apple cider vinegar. Mix one teaspoon of organic apple cider vinegar with a glass of water and drink this every day. Apple cider vinegar acts like a natural cleanser and detoxifier. It contains malic acid, which helps in breaking down and removing uric acid from the body. Apples also contain malic acid, and you should aim to eat at least one a day. 8. Try lime juice. Many experts advise drinking lime water at least twice a day to flush out the excess uric acid in your body. Lime contains citric acid, which helps in dissolving the uric acid. You should also eat foods rich in vitamin C, like lemons and oranges. 9. Eat antioxidant-rich fruits and vegetables. A recent study suggests that you should load up on more antioxidant-rich berries, like cherries, blueberries, and strawberries, if you're struggling with high levels of uric acid. Dark-colored berries contain flavonoids, which help in reducing inflammation and stiffness. Alkaline foods like tomatoes and bell peppers also help in balancing the acid levels in your body. 10. Stock up on celery seeds. Celery seeds are rich in omega-6 fatty acids and other diuretic oils. As a powerful diuretic, they help in cleaning the system of excess liquids by stimulating the kidneys to flush out the uric acid. They also alkalize your blood and lower inflammation in the body. You can take a half teaspoon of dried celery seeds once a day, but remember to have plenty of water with them, as they have a very high fiber content. 11. Indulge in high fiber foods. It's also recommended that you should add more high fiber foods to your diet in order to control the level of uric acid in the blood. Dietary fiber absorbs the excess uric acid in your blood and helps it to get eliminated from your body. Oats, bananas, and grains are good sources of soluble fiber. 12. Drink ginger root tea. 
Ginger works well against gout because it's an anti-inflammatory and an antioxidant, too. It contains two anti-inflammation agents. These agents help suppress the uric acid crystals in the blood, and this suppression relieves the gout sufferer from a flare-up. As an added bonus, it also makes it less likely to happen again in the future. To use ginger for gout, you can either incorporate it into your cooking or sip on ginger root tea, which is a super easy and effective way to get more ginger into your diet. Just cut up some ginger root into small pieces and then boil it in a saucepan of water. After five minutes or so, it'll be ready to drink. If you find the flavor pretty intense, adding some honey can take the edge off. 13. Use baking soda. Baking soda can reduce the amount of uric acid in the body, which is the main cause of gout, helping to relieve gout pain. Mix half a teaspoon into a glass of water and drink it up to four times a day for two weeks. Expert advice is that if you're above 60 years old, only drink the solution three times a day. 14. Try activated charcoal. Activated charcoal has started cropping up everywhere recently from our toothpaste to our deodorants. It's also one of the potential home gout remedies for pain and is safe to use as a natural remedy. The charcoal absorbs uric acid, which will help to reduce the effects of gout on the body. Either soak in a bath with half a cup of charcoal powder or create a paste with charcoal powder and water and apply to the affected area. 15. Take an Epsom salt bath. Epsom salt can ease pain related to inflammation, which can be beneficial for those who are suffering the effects of too much uric acid in the blood. In addition to reducing pain symptoms and promoting healing, Epsom salt can be dissolved in warm water to ease pain from gout, eliminate odor in the process. It contains high levels of magnesium, which works to reduce high blood pressure. Just soak your affected body part in a mixture of Epsom salt and warm water for pain relief and to reduce swelling. 16. Eat more bananas. You probably have these gout remedies right on your kitchen counter. The high level of potassium in bananas converts uric acid crystals in the body into liquid, which will then exit the body through urination. Bananas also contain vitamin C, which may help reduce gout. Bananas are also an anti-inflammatory food. Try adding one or two bananas to your daily food intake for your gout. 17. Up your magnesium intake. Magnesium is a dietary mineral that plays a big role in relieving gout and reducing uric acid levels. One study found that people with adequate magnesium levels have lower levels of uric acid, which can help to reduce gout risk. Try taking magnesium supplements or eat magnesium-rich foods such as avocado, banana, kale, or spinach daily to decrease gout risk or gout occurrence long term. A word about spinach. Though it is rich in magnesium, it's a high purine vegetable, and some doctors recommend you limit its consumption. However, studies have shown that vegetables that are high in purines, such as asparagus and spinach, don't increase the risk of gout or recurring gout attacks. 18. Use turmeric. One of the active ingredients in turmeric is called curcumin, which is used in traditional Chinese medicine to treat arthritis. Taking turmeric may also help gout because of its anti-inflammatory properties. One study found that curcumin can reduce uric acid levels, although more research is needed to understand exactly why. Turmeric is safe for most people, but it's wise to consult your doctor before taking turmeric supplements to make sure it doesn't interfere with any other medicines you take. 19. Eat more pineapple. Although there's a need for further scientific evidence to confirm pineapple's efficacy, it is believed its compound of digestive enzymes can reduce gout and ease pain. If you can't get fresh pineapples, canned pineapples or pineapple juice can help ease your pain. Just consuming pineapple in your preferred form daily to help reduce inflammation. Pineapple has a range of other health benefits, so it's ideal for using as a natural medicine. 20. Try Devil's Claw Extract. No, Devil's Claw Extract isn't as freaky as it sounds. Devil's Claw is an anti-inflammatory herb that gets its name because of its hooked claw-like appearance. More importantly, it can help ease the pain and is used in arthritis, gout, muscle pain, and back pain. It contains chemicals that might decrease inflammation and swelling and reduce pain. A word of warning, if you have diabetes or are using a blood-thinning medicine, don't take this herb. 21. Stock up on safflower capsules. Safflower is another natural plant that is used for a wide range of medicinal purposes. 
It can help relieve gout by its ability to neutralize uric acid and remove toxins and waste from the body. It also works as an anti-inflammatory and helps relieve painful, stiff joints. You can take safflower supplements on a daily basis as a natural gout treatment. 22. Use chamomile oil. Chamomile oil is a great essential oil with analgesic properties that can soothe the pain of inflamed joints and muscles. Simply mix it with a carrier oil like coconut and rub it straight onto the affected area to soothe your pain. Chamomile plant contains flavonoids, which have anti-inflammatory properties. These inflammation-reducing compounds easily penetrate the skin's surface to reduce inflammation. Finally, if you can't treat your gout naturally, it's worth booking in to see your doctor, who may be able to provide you with temporary pain relief. In the meantime, you can work on following these tips to improve your diet and keep your uric acid levels nice and low for the foreseeable future. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy this next video on which foods reduce or treat uric acid. Thank you for watching and bye for now.